really bad thunderstorm. Power has been flickering on and off. I've only got three minutes left. Three minutes. Yeah, it's bad, but we're gonna redo it all because of this. My spider too kind of, uh, it, it oozed like worse than a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movie. Um, we're gonna need some, we're gonna need some time. I was going to re just, you know, try to fix this and everything. I took out some screws to take off the heat sink and everything, but uh, I'm just gonna get a new one. Now that also brought up the, the matter of printing this out in resin. So I did, and um, she'd be curing right back there. Thanks to my Elegoo and my Creality machines, my Anycubic is becoming more of a Frankenstein. So, yeah, there's that. So you saw my video a while back on my failed prints. That would be print number five, maybe, maybe six. That's six prints that I had to do in order to actually get it to work. Why? Because I jumped into it at first. The last print, yeah, it worked a little bit because as I said, it's a really big print, but it still is a workable piece. And I am able to upgrade from a PETG part where there was no possible way for me to actually start printing in PETG because of the heat coming from that thing. Uh, I've tried, started to melt. But now I have a resin print that can take that sort of punishment. All right, just got done with the test fit. Just put the fan on and everything. And uh, it fit perfectly up here, right to the holes and everything. So, uh, looks like I, uh, I actually did it correctly. So, see a little bit of warping back here. This thing's just too big broken too big for the uh build plate on the creality hallet one so but um it came out really good so uh i can't complain whatsoever so as i said all the wonderful little mounting holes and everything fit up uh the only thing i didn't do was really hook it up because i need the new nozzle yeah In hindsight, 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 so in hindsight, I've noticed that my videos on the machines have done really well, so I'm going to stick with that for a little while. Again, this is my passion, so that's a good thing for me. But I want to know what you want to see. I'm not going to go into delving into all the big word videos that you can see from other creators out there. I just want to show you what you can make, how you can make it, and uh, stuff like that. I'm gonna touch on the computer part stuff. That's gonna be not fun for some of you, but I'm gonna try to dumb it down as much as I possibly can. Not for you, but for me, because it's easier that way. Keep it simple, stupid. So, that's about it. Is this thing even on? Hello?